can you know where do you where do you I know it's so early but um where does Sean go from here? I, I mean I have to think that he his stock hasn't gone down at all. You guys were in the fight of the year candidate. Um, you know, from thinking it now, where does Sean go from here? Does he jump right in with a big name again? I mean, it almost feels like he doesn't need to go through a rebuilding process. I mean, he could probably jump in with another top world tour right now. Do you guys feel the same way? Yeah, they could get him to another title fight. He's a deserving of one. <laughs> He's deserving of another title fight. Um, uh, I, I don't want to sit around for six to eight months. Definitely not a year. Um, mm-hmm. Sean has already started back working out. No, he's not doing boxing workouts. Uh, for fans who who don't know anything about this sport or who don't have the inside information to the type of training that we do, he's not overtraining. He can never overtrain. If your muscles are hurting when you're lifting weights, stop lifting the weights. If your legs are hurting when you run, don't run today. He can never overtrain. It doesn't happen. So when I read that, you know, when people have seen him already working out, they're saying don't overtrain. It doesn't happen. Okay, he's riding the bike. He's riding the bike to loosen his legs up. He's doing a lot of stretching. He's doing yoga. Um, yes, he's uh, also um, doing a rowing machine, but that is to loosen up his back muscles and things that may have been tight from the fight. Um, it's just, uh, for us, it's a, a way of life. You know, we don't do this. We don't box, just go to a camp to get in shape for a fight. So it is his livelihood to work out. This is what he does. Um, we are ready to go. We will be ready to go in 90 days. The only reason I'm saying 90 days is because I know it would take at least that much of a promotion for them to put a fight together and promote a fight <clears throat> for us. We could do it in the dark. We don't need to to promote a, a, a fight like we just did with Keith Thurman to get back in the ring. We're ready to get back in the ring. That night after the fight, Sean was saying, hey, I'm ready for round number 13. You know, <laughs> I wish we had four 15 rounds. So um, we're ready to go again. We will be ready to go within 90 days. Um, and uh, hopefully, you know, the people that we're involved with, you know, you know, they hear us making noise that we want to get back in there soon. Now, now, now Kenny, I don't know if I'm going to get an actual answer from you out of this question, but if, if I assume Keith is number one on your list. If not Keith, is there a name that you guys would like to get in the ring if you could tell, you know, PBC, Al, that you want this guy? Is there a guy that you guys would, would like to target next if it's not Keith? Huh, let me look at the list that I made yesterday. Oh, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I sent it to myself. Just give me a second here. Sure. Yeah, take your time. Uh, yeah, Keith Thumb is number one on that list for the rematch. Um, Danny Garcia, Andre Berto, John John yeah. Molina. Okay. Um, the guy he just fought, Ruslan Pavlikov. I like that Brandon, fight. Brand, Brandon Rios, if if Brandon has an interest. Yeah, those are, those would be the top guys. Top guys would be Keith Thurman, Danny Garcia, the guy that just won the fight a few weeks back, John John Molina. Mm-hmm. Uh, and you said Andre Berto too, right? Yeah, yeah. Andre Berto would be right, basically number three. So we got uh, Berto won a few weeks, you know, a, a couple of months back against uh, mm-hmm. Victor, and he looks spectacular doing it. Thank you. And uh, so, so um, Keith Thurman, Danny Garcia, Andre Berto, top fighters right there. Um, yeah. Another guy that just won a, a good fight, John John Molina, um, Ruslan Provotnikov, Brandon Rios. So we're ready to get back in there yeah, that's, that's within a, 90 days, September. That's a, that's a solid list. I like that list, Kenny. <laughs> yeah, there's other there's others on here, but those are the top guys. You know. And and one thing I did want to clear up, Kenny, because I, I you know Sean wasn't able to attend oh, the oh, post. Oh 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 yeah oh you know what we need to add 
you know, let's let's not leave out Adrian and Paulie since they have some nice little comments about the fight. They they can get it. <laughs> Let's not leave them out. Let's not leave them out. They don't. We don't want them to feel left out. What what, what comments are you referring to? Can I, Polly, I'm kind I don't of know. sure. I wasn't. I'm I don't not sure about Adrian. I, I I don't know. I didn't. I didn't see it. You know, just people want to send me texts and tell me that they're saying things, and I'm not looking at it right now. I'm not looking at any of that stuff because, like I said, I just want Sean to go ahead and just relax um, for this week. And not do any of that. So he's going to do the Fourth of July parade back home. He's going to visit with his grandmother, and you know, he's going to visit with his friends and things like that. 